first conceived of this idea of spending two weeks in uh, Tuscany uh, sculpting with my fellow artists. What I was hoping to have a chance to be with other artists for such a long period of time, whether it's in the studio working or having dinner somewhere in a medieval village afterwards and, and uh, just letting things magically, inspirationally uh, would happen to us um, here. And it, it's, it kind of has in ways that I hadn't thought before. When I came here, I was looking for something that it's difficult to get in our world because we are solitary people. We work in our studio all day long. We don't have opportunities to talk to colleagues. So I was, I was looking for companionship in my love of what I'm doing and I found more than I thought I would. So you're in a room with people who are in theory in competition with your skills and after a few days you realize that there is no competition. And that was one of the biggest surprises I've had in this whole adventure was the fact that all of a sudden we were all working together on things different. Everybody has an input on everything. Uh, it was uh, very unexpected to have that much um, camaraderie between everybody and genuine friendship. On it, keep it wet and you'll be fine. They, they can take them so it's very different than a class where everybody comes to learn something new. Here, people were coming to do what they do because they do it well. That was a really fun thing to realize for me. You know, the unexpected part of this was that there's others of similar skill level, other sculptors here, and we've all shared the experience and we've worked off of each other and learned from each other. And that was more than I could have asked for, more than I, could, I imagined would happen. But we're all open to uh, each other within the group, and those insecurities get dispelled. So there's, there's that, that courage and that uh, hope and, and the unity, the feeling of being a part of something that I think has affected everyone's work here. What's that, what do you think? So if you put like a cap like this cap on there, I've enjoyed my one-on-one -on -one time with each and every one of these people. And because I'm in the environment that I am in, everyone around me just rolls with whatever I choose to do. And I watch them uh, do what they want to do. So it's a very malleable experience. And because it's set up in such a way that we can do whatever we want to do and it, it bodes well for everyone, it puts different people into interactive situations that I can't imagine that they would be in, in under any other circumstances. I will never forget this experience. I, and it's also changed the trajectory of my thinking. It's, as artists, we're self-deprecating and we don't believe all the accolades we get or we don't believe when somebody says it. But when you're with your peers and, and we're helping each other out and cheering each other on, it's just that you believe, I, I deserve to be here. And I, I finally believe that. Yeah, just because this is dinner. <laughs> Being in Tuscany has changed me as a human being. I've always been quite alone in what I do and how I approach what I do. Being with these other artists and everybody sharing their expertise and their stories and their trials and tribulations, I think that's the biggest thing I'm going to go back with. It's going to be um, a love fest from now on, it really is. Just for myself, when I thought about my colleagues before, you know, I'm very impressed with their styles and their careers, and I wanted to make myself look impressive also. And, and now we've become really good friends, I think, and, and being here and really uh, giving me a sense of self that um, I think I'll carry with me forever. So something happens when a group of people get together. They start sharing ideas and it's like the fertilization of, of different ideas and thoughts and whether it's even intentional or not we can't help but rub off on each other and I'm 
floored. I'm so grateful. It's, it's so fun to watch people step up and uh, critique each other, support each other, um, inform each other, talk about their own perspectives about work and about life. Um, and I think what will come from this is, um, is going to be beyond our wildest dreams.